Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys. Peep game. All right, man. Hell of a finish uh, to the game with the Chicago Bears versus the Washington Commanders. When I say that was just, I'm talking about that is what you call um, persistence, and that's what you call the will to win. They could have gave up on that play and just said, you know what, we just going to, you know, call a running play and just run out the clock. But they decided to go for it all. They did not want to take the chance of trying to kick a 60-yard field goal. And for Jalen Daniels to hoist that ball that far away and able to get that ball, make it even possible for a catch, that says a lot about him. Keep in mind, this is the number one and the number two overall picks of this year's draft. You know, Caleb Williams and Jalen Daniels, the number one and the number two all-around pick. And this time, Jalen Daniels prevailed. That was just an awesome play. I'm talking about, man, if you are a, you know, Commanders fan, you should just be like, wow, you know, and it looked like they got their franchise quarterback, you know, and I'm also going to do a video in regards to something that a terminology that we need to bury now. And I don't want people to take it the wrong way. Because, you know, sometimes people misinterpret things, but I'm going to do the video anyway, because like I said before, I feel like it's important that we get this conversation out the way. So, man, kudos, kudos. And it's great to see a play like that when it first happened. And I sat up there when I, I, I saw it, I hit LV up because LV from the DFV. I said, man, did you just see what the, I said? Did you just see what happened with, with the man, with the commanders of the Chicago Bears? That was I was like, damn, that's crazy. And then LV went and looked at it. He was like, damn, that was a hell of a play. I mean, you have to give props. When you see plays like that, and that was just, you know, that's that was just one for the ages. You know, I hadn't seen nothing like that in a while. You know, that reminded me of that Hail Mary that Doug Flutie uh, threw, you know, back in like 1985 or something. But, you know, me seeing this one, it was just as good. So there you have it. Anyway, this your boy Town Biz. I'm out.